Hey folks, what's here? Welcome back to another Pokemon Masters video, and today I'm going to do Battleville again, which I haven't done in a while, because, uh, uh Battleville videos are usually super long, right, and there's just so many, like, updates that have been coming out and stuff that I just had to do, um, and prioritize over the Battleville video, so, yeah, I haven't been doing them lately, unfortunately. Like, I mean, like, the videos are literally, like, 40 minutes to, like, an hour long, and then, like, that's only, like, the on-screen stuff, like, the stuff I do, like, you know, um, off-screen, the team comps, all that stuff, um, strategizing, editing video, all that stuff. Oh, like it, it, one of these videos just takes like around three to four hours to actually make. So <laughs> these, these take well. So anyways, um, we're going to go up against Hilda. And if you're wondering why am I bringing Team Metagross instead of like blue or Crobat or whatever, um, I don't want to use them anymore. Like I, we've, we've done this stage like a billion times. They're super lame. I, I want to use something new. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and use Team Metagross. Um, and for Metagross, we got four Iron Head power-ups. Recuperation, Haymaker for the sync move. Uh, Iron Head move gate refresh, Iron Head aggravation, right? Which is probably the most important um, grid a note here, just because like Flinch is just so good in Villa in comparison to like anywhere else. Because uh, like Flinch actually like in Villa, um, a lot of the opponents actually don't have like less lesser Flinch, like the higher uh, levels of less than Flinch that all the other stages have. They usually have either none or like three, four, or five, which does actually uh, keep them Flinch for a while. Um, so as for our sports, we got Phoebe Dustmore for a crit, obviously, and then also some move gauge, I guess, and attack buffs and shadow punch to do some chip damage and also for a single move countdown. And for my last, you know, slot, I didn't know who to go with. Um, NCS did suggest Kukui and Lycanroc to me, which, if he hadn't, I would probably forgot, you know, completely forgot about this guy, uh, that he existed. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, Kukui and Lycanroc is really good for the Bella. Um, just because of one car, uh, one, one gauge spammed with one car. <laughs> Gage plus bar, um, spamble leer, right, and also really good speed. So yeah, let's let's go do this then. Um, hopefully we get to queue up three moves before the opponent queues up their first move because that would be kind of huge for us, right? So uh, yeah, let's see how this goes. It would be really nice if we had like slower speeds, honestly. Okay, let's uh, let's do this. Let's do this. Um, we're, yeah, we're gonna do leer first, definitely. Oh, leer buff buff. Yeah, we should do that. Alright, alright, alright. Q moves really quick before we use a move. Yes, we queued it before Rock Smash, so that gives us that. That's a piece basically a free turn then. <laughs> alright, let's start our head again. And let's go ahead and iron head this since we have gauges. And hopefully we get a flinch here. That would be really, really nice if we get a flinch here um, on them so we don't get hit by an energy ball. Which, you know, energy ball doesn't hurt that much, but it'd be nice if we don't get hit by one as well. Alright, kill Shadow Punch there. Go up X attack. Flinch, please. Rip. No flinch. <laughs> Alright. Let's go ahead and, and sync the uh the, the skip loom over here. Um or not flip the uh the sync move on the um skip loom. Hopefully we can take it out. Is that enough? Rip, rip. Um alright, incoming sync move. Against that, Q up Leer. Let's give another shadow punch, take that, the cottony out, and then we'll keep an iron head right after to uh, hopefully flinch whatever the heck is coming out there right iron head please flinch <laughs> and um all right leer again i mean twin needle's not like the biggest deal unless uh, it actually would be a big deal if we get poison so please no poison poison please that would be cool all right let's go and break, break the bonds again let's see if we can take this out over here and the answer is no <laughs> can we flinch though nope rip well that kind of sucks oh and the poison that Sucks even more. <laughs> and incoming play rough as well. So, yikes. Um, well, we did get that in, I guess. Um, we get. Oh, I was hoping for a flinch, but we took it out instead, which is which is better. Which is better. <laughs> I'll take that. I'll definitely take that. Um, can we shadow punch take out the area dose before we die? Because it's about to sink with us. Um, and we also have our sink move after that, so we. Get to sync move Salamence as soon as Salamence comes out, right? So, oh, there goes Dust Noir. Rip, but uh, yeah, can't do much about that, unfortunately. All right, let's go Iron Head that. Hopefully, get a flinch on that. That'll be nice. But we, oh, oh, we got we got a flinch. There we go. There we go. So yeah, I guess we could leave Kingdom for a bit, maybe. Right. Um, let's get that. Oh, forgot to queue up Leer. Got to kill play. Okay, there we go. We're good. Uh, I kind of wasted a bit of gauges though, which is kind of important now that Dustbob is dead. All right, and there goes that. 
Um, let's go Iron Head the um the 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 Gramble over here. To so that uh defense down, all that stuff. Can we take this thing out with like bullet punches? Oh, we got a flinch there as well. That's really nice. Throw a bullet punch in there. Um, star hit all. That's definitely not good. I guess. Maybe another bullet punch would be able to take. Oh no no, that was enough. That was enough. All right all right all right. That's definitely nice. Um, this iron head should take it out. I would assume. Just, just you know, all the defense downs and all that stuff. Yep, and it is enough. So there we go. Let's shoot another iron head over here. Um, please get another flinch. That'll be really nice as well. Um, <laughs> get Leer in, and I think we need one more Iron Head for our, um, sync move, right? Um, or, but, hmm, let's see, are we close to taking it out? If we're close to taking it out, we probably just bull punch here instead, right? Yeah, let's do that, let's do that. Let's bull punch it instead. Uh, probably shouldn't have queued up that Leer, honestly. Oh well. Go sync move the the uh, the hacks was coming in. Actually, you know what? No, no, that 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 really was good. That really was good. All right, um, incoming sync move. So about to they're about to hit us with something. Um, well, their sync move, right? Let's get our best there is. Get some extra defenses there, so we don't get just like absolutely just trucked by it, which would be nice. All right, throwing leer. Okay, here is where we need the flinches. We need to flinch it so it doesn't like just. Spam Outrage on us, because Outrages hurt a lot. <laughs> Alright, incoming... Ouch. Ouch, 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 ouch. Alright, uh, let's go Leer. Okay, here's the Outrage. Please, 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 please flinch. Please flinch. Please flinch, game. We need to flinch here really, really bad. Yes, 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 yes. We got the flinch. We got the flinch. We got the flinch. Alright, um, Haxorus actually comes out of flinch relatively early, which is super annoying. Um, but, you know, we can't do much about it. So, let's do another best there is, get some more defenses, also, you know, for our sync move, right? I think we got this, I think, I think we got this. Alright, looks like we can actually 3v9 this stage. Alright, if you guys don't know, 3v9ing a stage is really, really difficult. There's only a set amount of strikers that actually do this, right? Um, so, some units, like Red could, Red could definitely 3v9 a stage, Cynthia could 3v9 a stage, Guzm could do it, and it looks like Steven... Can do it and just did it over there. <laughs> so there we go. So we didn't have to use a second team, one team. That all it took. Like Kuku is still alive. Not that it really mattered. You know, they. I. I. I would have thought. You know. Uh, you know. Uh, I going in. I thought we could probably. We could probably bring them down to like Haxorus, and then like Haxorus is maybe like under like a third of its HP, and then like they wipe our team out. But damn, we actually just we just beat it. Which I, I, I was definitely not um, expecting. But uh, yeah, um, I've heard, I, again, I've heard people talking about Steven 3v9 in stages. I just never personally, tr you know, ever tried it out before. So I didn't know if that was actually true or not. But apparently it is. <laughs> so Steven can 3v9, you know, a villa stage, which is definitely makes him, you know, one of the best um, strikers here. Wow. Okay, let's get some extra rewards. Again, we're in no hurry. We're in no hurry. Um, so we're, we'll take the extra rewards, uh, instead of, you know, all the other stuff, which is some Elite Four notes, but, uh, I'll take it. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, let me go game plan for the next few stages, or, well, just the next stage. Alright, folks, so this is the team we're gonna go with, right? Um, so we're gonna go Clement, Heliosk, um, Prince Oak Mew, and, uh, Sabrina Exam. So, if you're running, well, who the heck is Striker? Well, it's Sabrina Exam. Um, reason being is Mewtwo is boring, <laughs> and Sabrina does... Uh, just as so much, if not more, than Mewtwo in terms of damage anyways. And, uh, yeah, let's let's try that out. Uh, like, every single time I do the stage, it's Mewtwo, it's Mewtwo, it's Mewtwo, it's Mewtwo. Let, let's try something else uh, this time. I was thinking, try to do Reuniclus or um, Sabrina Alexam, and I, and I think I want to sell with um, Sabrina Alexam this time. Because it's Sabrina, and Sabrina's great. Um, so, as for our... Um, I would finally get to use Clement and Helios as intended here. Um, so we're going to go with both Mudslap, Move Gauge Refreshes, and then the other stuff, Electro Web stuff, which we probably won't even use, honestly. It's just, it's just mainly the Mud Slap move gauge refreshes. And then Mew's just, just standard Mew, right? So, um, yeah, let's let's try this out. Let's see how, uh, let's see how this does. Alright, um, so we're just going to start this out. Uh, 
let's star hit ourselves. Well, star it's well it's star hitting everyone, but this time it's gonna be used mainly for herself, <laughs> which is rare. Don't really do that a lot. And then just mud slap, and then I don't know, swift I guess. <laughs> All right, let's do that. Let's see if we could get MP for some. Yeah, wait, actually, I don't, I don't even think I do have um MP. Uh, get a refresh on that. Anyways, okay, never mind. Doesn't matter. <laughs> let's do our stuff. All right, let's use all the buffs here because again, I'm not too worried about clearing this in like two days since it's already like the fifth day or something. Uh, like I said, I I just don't have much time to do um. You know, uh, Battle Villa runs recently just because of all the update, update and stuff, right? Stuff. Stuff. <laughs> um, I think we should have our sync move after... After another... Yeah, 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 after that Swift, right? So, um, yeah, let's go ahead and just use that sync move on that, uh, Wing Bell, right? Because, you know, she's trying to take out the, uh, the sides first, as usual, with Battle Villa, right? We don't want to worry too much about the mid. Um, at least in, you know, this case, right? So let's do that, and plus the Rain Sync move doesn't do too much damage. Anyways, like, this Psychic probably does as much damage as that. Maybe not, but we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. We're about to use it. <laughs> let's, let's see if it does or not. Um, incoming Swift. Can I get some movie regens here? And... Uh, yeah, yeah, it's, it's about the same damage, <laughs> which makes sense, right, on paper. Um... Do we even use our second sixth sense? I don't even think we did. Anyways, doesn't matter. Um, or unless we got like an MP refresh over there. It's at minus five, one more, and then it's gonna be at minus six. Uh, we didn't dodge anything, I don't think, though. So we got really bad luck there, unfortunately. Can we get some move gauge refreshes, please? Damn, we're just not dodging anything right now. We can dodge a sludge bomb at least. You know what? Actually, I don't want to dodge a sludge bomb. Let's actually have it hit and trigger our um, first aid. That would actually be just much better for us, honestly. Um, alright, 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 nice. Sludge Bomb incoming, and we avoided it. Oh. Well, <laughs> well, let's think we should bring it under first aid threshold, and there we go. Well, we finally avoided a move, and it's the one time I did not want to avoid it. <laughs> Anyways, well, that's interesting. Let's um, well, I'll take I'll take the W. I'll take the W. <laughs> and uh, yeah, let's move on to the next one then. Um, yeah, let me think about who I actually want to use for the next stage, and I'll uh, get back to you guys once I made that uh, decision. So this is the team we're gonna go with, right? Um, Fenty because no one's ever used her ever. No, okay, uh, probably someone's probably used her before. I mean, Fenty is great. Fenty is great. I think she's kind of underrated. Um, since like she's a really good striker, but the reason why. I think people do kind of underrate her a bit, and and it's not because she's, you know, insanely good or whatever. Um, she did get shafted hard on her release, right? Because every single unit since Steven, um, I'm pretty sure at release got a Syncret exp uh, expansion, right? As soon as they release, they get a Syncret expansion um, at the same time. And Fantina, Fantina, I think, was the only unit that did not get a Syncret expansion. Like, even Plumeria got it, right? And she was, like, right after Sabrina, so I don't think a lot of people pulled for her, right? Um, again, she's a solid ghost type striker, and uh, let's let's try her out here. So same tanks, uh, Mew and Clement Helios. Let me just check my order. I don't want Miss Magius to get hit if for some reason uh, Mew dies here. Um, yeah, yeah. Let's let's change that real quick. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's get in this and and see how this goes. So I think I'm gonna you know X special attack first, and then go switch over to Clement. Mud slap, all that stuff, and hopefully we could dodge quite a few hits with um, Mew, because yeah, Mew, it's a dodge. <laughs> all right, all right. Well, let's see how this goes. Kill up moves. Hopefully, we queue up for the dust more fuse up anything. That'd be really cool. No, 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 no. I queued up the wrong move as well. <laughs> Supposed to queue up Swift there. Rip. Um, incoming Shadow Punch. This is not double edge, I guess. All right. Yeah, that was definitely the wrong move. <laughs> we do not need speed here. <laughs> we have so much, like, move gauge stuff. Um, let's go ahead and Shadow Ball. Uh, hopefully we do these in man. I don't expect us to take that in one hit, though, since we don't have crit or whatever. Um, we, I mean, we do have it, but we, you know, we're just not using it right now. Alright, let's see. Shadow Ball damage, and, uh, okay. That makes sense. Uh, another one should take it out. 
And we also would have our sync move up after this, right? So, um, I would have normally just not hit it, but just because it was, like, right about to, like, use a move, I'll just use another one to take it out. Oh, we probably should have, you know, got away with it if we just went for, um, uh, the Omnis win as well, so, oh well. Not that it matters, not that it matters. <laughs> Let's throw that in, and it's okay, she damaged. Again, we don't have crit or whatever yet, right? Um... I'm just waiting for, like, Mudsap to slap to, like, stop giving us move gauges so I could actually have an excuse to use this to give us some move gauges with that. You know what? Let's let's use Dance With Me after after this, uh, Swift. Like, why not? Let's just do that. So we get some crit. Do a bit more damage. Right? Um, let's go that. I think one is enough here, right? And incoming mud slap again. And we got all the move gauges in the world now. <laughs> again. Um, Swift. And there we go. Alright, nice. Um, that, yeah, that, that's one of the reasons I really don't like this move. It's like... Why do you like have to like tie in the crit with, <laughs> with like move gauge though? It's super annoying to me personally. Alright, we do have our sync move up after this Shadow Ball. So let's just go ahead and do that. Or slash wait for that. To uh, commence. We're going to do an X speed all. Which is not the biggest in the world, but kind of sucks. Uh, let's go that, that, parabolic charge, I guess. I don't know. I think it's at, you know, minus six accuracy, right? I could be wrong, though. Can we get a, uh, Omnis Wind to take it out? I think I'm going sync move, though. It's probably gonna hurt. Um, get some HP back before we're done here. <laughs> um, hopefully it doesn't bring you down to, uh, first aid range again. That kind of sucks. And, okay, all right. We're good. We're good. We're not in first aid range, so we're gonna get first aid again once this comes back. And is that enough? That is enough. I do not want to get hit by the double edge <laughs> for sure. All right. So yeah, there's uh, there's that stage. Like the twelfth stage or something, right? Got some cookies. Cool. <laughs> and um, yeah, there we go. There we go. Um, next stage, bug. Let's uh, let me see what um, I could come up with uh, for the next stage then. Alright, so, unfortunately, I finished the last round, um, Hall 12, um, with Fantina, and, uh, after I finished it, I noticed I didn't click record, so, rip, uh, but we beat it with Fantina, Fantina, Mew, and, uh, I think Clement, right, so that's why Mew's at, you know, solely HP, and, uh, Fantina is also... I can't remember how much HP Fantina had, but... Fantina did well there. Fantina definitely did well there. Um... But, yeah, unfortunately I didn't record it, which is kind of sad. Anyways, um, yeah, for this stage, we're gonna try this. Uh, we're gonna go Pinsir, because it's Bug Week. And Pinsir, Leaf, Eevee, and Oak and Mew, just to tank before... As much as possible before it dies, because it's probably about to die soon. And, uh, Eevee for, I guess, heals, all that stuff. And most importantly, just for Eevee's, um, um, sync move, honestly. And also potion, right? So, we're mainly gonna use it for Eevee's potion. And then we're just gonna not stop Fury Cutter. We're not even gonna go Mega. Because, you know, that you know, breaks the Fury Cutter thing, right? We're just gonna keep on Fury Cuttering until, um, we just get insane amounts of damage on, on one gauge move. <laughs> we'll see how well it goes. We'll see how well it goes. I've never tried this before. And, um, again... All experimental stuff, <laughs> and uh, we'll, we'll we'll see how well it goes. Um, let's see, let's see. Target one of the sides and start Fury Cutter as soon as possible. Let's go do that. Let's Swift here. Um, I accidentally click next speed when I was doing that stage as well with me, which kind of sucks. Um, all right, got first aid there. Fully healed, all that stuff. Right, let's just keep on Fury Cuttering. Or using Fury Cutter, I guess. Fury Cutter? Is that that thing? Probably not. Um, I don't think we'll ever be in trouble in terms of our move gauge for Fury Cutter. We might be in trouble for like our move gauge for like Swift, maybe. But like, I mean, it's a one gauge move. It's like not that big a deal. <laughs> All right, so we're at 200 damage now with Fury Cutter, and we should have our sync move up really, really soon. Um, all right, after Mew's Q over here, we should have our sync move up. And then we should have up oh, there we go. Um we queue that. 405 now. And that's just gonna buff everyone's stats. The whole team. Also defense stats, which is pretty important as well. And I forgot to queue. Swift on Mew, also speed. Right? Just everything except for like crit, right? And I think do we get evasion? 
I don't know if we got evasion. I can't remember. It's been a while. Um, actually, so yeah, yeah. Except for crit and evasion, which sucks, but not the biggest deal. Also, we do get accuracy on pincer, so uh, fury cutter is not going to miss here anymore. So obviously, missing would kind of suck because, <laughs> well, if we miss that. You know, that breaks our chain as well. Um, so we don't want it to miss. All right. Here we go. Tackle again. Let me see. Uh, we got four more turns. So after this, we queue one more Fury Cutter and we'll have... Uh, oh, shouldn't have hit that one. I didn't see its HP there. Uh, we should have EV Sync move up again. And then we'll uh, have all the stats at plus four then. Alright. Again, this is... Heavy's great because, like, you just, like... Not only do you have Potion, you also have the Sync move, which does not need to use any MP. And, uh, yeah, oh my god. We're just taking, like, nothing from that. From the uh, defensive boost that we get from EV as well, which is really nice. All right, let's queue that. Let's queue Swift. Let's queue Fury Cutter. Okay, that, that actually did, did decent amount. Um, incoming flinch. So we can't do that uh, Swift over there, which is unfortunate. But uh, oh well. <laughs> not the biggest deal in the world, I don't think. All right, let's see how much Fury Cutter does now. 1.5k on one gauge. Yeah. Just, you know, just on top spamming. Um, might be a bit overkill, just because of you know, just how little move gauge we just need to use here like at all right just to do everything all right i think one more fear cutter might finish it off all right oh we got swift up <laughs> well there we go <laughs> that was that was way more effective than, than i uh than i imagine right and our mew going in didn't have too much hp so we had to use a potion there so if you didn't have to use a potion it'll be even even better so uh yeah we're on to our first sub sub boss here right um for this group and uh yeah we barely have anything left <laughs> because again we've just been like expanding like expanding like everything we're just gonna go in and do some chip damage and and we'll see how much we can do again um like i said for i'm not worried about time I'm not gonna rush it I'm just gonna have fun with these stages try out some new sync that i generally don't use before and uh yeah i'll see you guys uh in a second then right, folks so with the ragtag you know pretty uh broken um units that we have at the moment i think this is probably our, our best bet right so all we need is just to like do the best as we that we can on, on their sides hopefully we can take all the sides out and then and then we'll deal with the mids with like the other half of the <laughs> units that we have left so sabrina we've repurposed her back into a tank right we got uh we, we got recuperation um which we will be seeking with sabrina just to get hp back right got recuperation there um, we got Reflect, all the Reflect stuff, Pep Rally on that, and then we also got On the Ropes as well, which I've never used before, but, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see how well it does. And then, over here, Clement, Heliosk, uh, for gauges, I guess, and also Electro Web, although we'll probably be Electro Webbing a lot. Um, and then, I think Miss Magius for damage, I guess, maybe? <laughs> Anyways, who knows, who knows? Well, we'll see how this goes. Maybe it's really a lot of damage here. Okay, no. Sabrina's probably not going to outdamage her. Sabrina is, uh, again, in, in support mode uh, at the moment. So, alright, let's see how this goes. Let's just start this out with um, Reflect. Reflect, let's get the uh, Electro Web in, and then Dance With Me to get Gages back. Unfortunately, we didn't queue that up before Earthquake, which is slightly unfortunate, but also not the biggest in the world. Um, can we get a MP refresh on that? Electro Web, let's do that. Ah, it doesn't matter, we're getting Gages from Dance With Me. Sorry about that. Anyways, let's do that. Got the gauges there. Um, and then, I guess, just Shadow Ball on these sides. See if you can take them out um, for the most part. Do that. Side Beam again. Um, another Electro Web. Ouch. That kind of hurt. <laughs> oh no. Damn it. Well, I mean, Sabrina is psychic, so it makes sense that she's doing more damage here. Uh, okay, after that, Shadow Ball, we should have our sync move up, right? So let's not queue anything here. We're gonna sync move. We're gonna probably sync move the, um, the sock here. Is, or is that throw? I think that's throw. Um, that's not enough, unfortunately, but this should be, right? And then we'll show up here again. Just queue up all that stuff, right? And here we go. How much damage? Oof. Yeah, that child ball should be able to take that out, um, which is really nice. So we'll just go ahead and, and queue Psychic over here and just hopefully deal some damage on, on that as well, right? And we're out of move gauges. So I guess we should stop using Electro and just go back to Mud Slapping so we can get move gauges, right? 
Um, let's hit the mid here with that mud slap. Um, let's see, Shadow Ball. Get the Shadow Ball. Do some damage there. Can we take that? No, no. Okay, we definitely can't take that out like that. Um, looks six cents. Give some HP back there to Fantina, as well as, uh, you know, just damage, I guess. Um, special attack buffs, all that stuff. Um, ouch, but not really. Alright, so after this Psychic from Sabrina, we should have our Sync move up again, so let's not queue anything there. And we could Sync move this other Nidoran, right? And then afterwards we could start, hopefully, if that's enough to take it out, then we could start uh, hitting the mid. Right. Yeah, yeah, we could definitely take out the sides. For sure, for sure. Alright. Let's get that Psychic in, there's that, and then, alright, well hopefully we don't die here, though, <laughs> and we get our uh, recuperation stuff, okay, we're good, we're good, um, I am kind of assuming that this should be enough to take it out, though, if it's not, then we're kind of screwed, okay, okay, we're good, oh damn, Sabrina, poor, <laughs> poor Miss Magus, we brought Miss Magus here to do damage, and it's just been Sabrina doing all the damage this whole time, okay, there's the damage, there's the damage from Miss Magius. Really nice. That's that's definitely good. Um, let's parabolic charge. Get some uh, ooh, that back HP back. Oof! Unfortunately, Miss Magius could not survive. <laughs> okay. Well, let's let's see what, what we could do with Sabrina here then. Um, in terms of damage, all that stuff, right? Um, can we take out Solar Rock at least? I just need to take out Solar Rock. So I'm gonna have to deal with Solar Rock in in, in our next run. With I would assume something like, uh, uh, on the ropes, save me, nope, rip, 118, oh, there we go, um, that was not bad, that was not bad, right, <laughs> with whatever the heck that was. I, was, I was hoping Sabrina would tank, but she ended up doing damage instead, well, she did tank really, really well, but <laughs> she ended up as our main striker, again, for some reason, um, even though it's a completely tank build, and she should not be doing that much damage, <laughs> So, anyways, um, yeah, let's, um, let me go make up another team, and hopefully that should be enough to take out this stage. Alright, so this is the team we're gonna go with, I guess. So, uh, Leaf and Eevee's gonna tank, right? Um, and, and, you know, heal all that stuff. Pinsir's gonna do damage, and Kui Like Rock is just there because we need another unit. Well, it's also for lowering defense. Maybe we could Excel Rock, take out the, uh, Solar Rock. Well, it's, you know, since it's almost dead anyways. And then again, we're just gonna sync with Eevee, not use Mega Pinsir sync move. So, um, yeah, let's uh, let's let's try this out then. Um, we're probably gonna let, let's let's heal with Pinsir first, because Pinsir did take some damage, and you know don't want to just get sync moved and then just like have Pinsir die, because that would be kind of awkward. Uh, let's do that in. Let's go Cell Rock. Hopefully that's enough to take it out. Not confident. <laughs> let's get next attacking. Um, since we can and. Ouch. I think we could take another hit before we have to heal with Eevee. Right, is that enough? No, it is not. It's Rock Doom. That should probably be enough. Uh, do we have to Rock Doom? Probably not. <laughs> Why do we do it? I don't know. Um, earthquake. Oh, well, we took it out before it Earthquake. So that's nice. Alright, so we do have our Sync move after this Leer. So again, we're just going to use it on um, Eevee and not uh, Pinsir. Right. Um, so let's do that. Just... If not anything, just for like for the defenses, honestly. Just really want the defenses more than anything. Like, damage is whatever. And, you know, when we Mega Pinsir, it's mostly we're just getting damage, right? So, which is not. I don't even know. Probably not. It's not even as much as uh, what Eevee gives there, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Eevee's, um, Eevee stat buffs give us just more than, than what we would have gotten if we mega would honestly. Um, and the action is really, really good for your cut as well. We do not want the streak to break. So, all things considered, right, right decision there. <laughs> all right, uh, let's rock to him, I guess. They did, they did just X defense all though. Okay, let's heal with Eevee ourselves. There we go. Um, rock to himself and down a bit, and then we have our sync move again. Hopefully, Eevee survives until it gets to use the next sync move. That'd be really, really nice. Oh well, well we're gonna potion. We're definitely gonna survive. Maybe if I, if we do another one, then. Um, maybe this would be enough defenses so that, like, Lycanroc doesn't die after, uh, I guess the opponent's think ah, no, no, the they're, they're gonna take Lycanroc, I don't think Lycanroc has survived here, unfortunately. 
All right, so there we go. More defenses. Well, that is good. And Leer again. They're at minus two. Okay, Fear Cutter starting to do a lot of damage now. Um, to make tackle, Psychic on Eevee. Ouch, hopefully Eevee doesn't die after the sync move. Is this Lycanroc's last Leer? <laughs> I don't know. Rock Tomb, let's do that. Fear Cutter, tackle, Rock Tomb, tackle. Okay. How is this? Okay, well, well I mean, that's kind of expected from, from Lycanroc, right? Um, it'll be a minor miracle if Lycanroc survived that. <laughs> but we should be almost done here. So it should be good. Are we going to survive that Psychic, though? Are we going to survive that Psychic, though? Because if we can, we get another Sync move in. Just to give uh, Pinsir a bit more. Rip. Okay, apparently not. So, uh, I guess not the biggest deal. Let's uh, get three Cutters in, and then let's finish it off with a Mega. I don't think the Swift's going to take us out, is it? Okay, no, we're good. Alright, finish us off with a Mega Pinsir. Sync move. Because Mega Pinsir's nice, I guess. There we go. Alright, wow. All those buffs. 6k. There we go, there we go, there we go. Not too bad, not too bad. Um, I mean, we, we got nothing left. <laughs> no need for much game planning here. Let's just run in with... Um, it's against Nolan, right? This set. Uh, let's just go run with our, uh, I think, Mew and... Mew and Metagross. You know what? Mew could probably tank for a while. Maybe we might actually deal some, like, okay -ish I don't know. Oh, oh, oh yeah, Nolan's still alive. Nolan's still alive. Wow, Nolan being alive is, is, is really nice here. Um, definitely, because we get, we get a bit of speed, right? And, uh, yeah, that, that's definitely really good. Um, let's put, actually, you know what? Let's, let's put, let's put Nolan in the middle. And, hmm. Yeah, let's put Nolan in the middle. We'll put Mew on the left side, and then we'll put uh, Metagross on, on the right side. Uh, what does Metagross have again? Um, left here. Or, ooh, nothing. <laughs> Basically nothing. Okay, so we're just gonna go in and, and like, Iron Head. And, again, we're, we're, like, if we take out one Pokemon, that's, that's mission accomplished for us, honestly. Um, <laughs> probably not gonna do any of that, though. Alright, uh, let's just hit one from one of the sides and see how much damage you can do before it's over. Uh, let's go put Psychic Bandana. And you know what? Since we're not gonna, like, do much of the sides anyways, well, let's actually... Let's actually, like, deal some, like, see how much damage we could do to the, uh, mid. Alright, let's check our, uh, opponent attacking priority thing. Tactics. Definitely want no one, even though it's such, it's just, he's just gonna take, like, one hit. But hey, that's, that's one hit more than, than he... You know, the, the, that, that Steven doesn't take. Alright. Okay, let's do this then. Um, we're just gonna use all Mew's buffs that Mew has. Which, Mew actually has a decent amount of buffs left, right? So that's cool, I guess. Not that it's really that useful. <laughs> I can't believe we, we still have, like, three left here. To, like, make it uh, actually full three team. Okay, let's um, heal ourselves here. Maybe take another hit slash sync move countdown. Um... So let's do that, let's put this in, and then Iron Head, and I guess Sex Attack as well, because why not. Alright, defenses, would've been nice if it was special defense though, would've been nice if it was special defense. Here comes the first aid, that's nice. Can we get a flinch? Yes we can, that's definitely good. Um, you know what, since we've got a flinch though, let's go hit one of the sides. <laughs> Um, and let's Fury Cutter. Maybe, uh, you know what? We probably should have not Fury Cutter. <laughs> that did nothing. Probably should have, uh, exited. Because, again, we're just, it, dude's gonna die soon. <laughs> right? So, um, yeah, maybe we probably should have. Oops, that was the wrong move to Q. Since we do have a sync move up with, um, with Steven here. And we do have recuperation still, so we're, so we're gonna heal after that for Steven. So Steven's gonna be here for a while. Hopefully. Um, and that would be cool if he is. Alright, Fear Cutter again. Um, yeah, yeah, we should win. <laughs> I don't think Mew's gonna survive that long. Well, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. He might survive long enough. Ooh, oh my god, that's so much HP back, man. Dude, he's so good. He's so good, man. Alright, even with all this, like, speed buff, like, we're still, like, slightly struggling on, on, on gauges. Alright, um, let's Iron Head again, 
Fear Cutter. I don't think we're gonna start. I have the same move um, for Pinsir. Maybe Mew? Um, Mega Gross should probably survive it. Fine. Okay. Mew. Barely survived it. Pinsir surprisingly survived it somehow. Uh, but hey, I'll take it. I'll definitely take that. Um, Fear Cutter again. Just go in for another. Uh, actually, let's go for Bullet Punch since they're still flinched, right? Before we get that out of the way. Um, did we cue the Fury Cutter before side being- Ooh, we did not. That's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. Also, we got Sync Move again with Metagross, but I accidentally queued up an Iron Head because I can't count. <laughs> and I forgot that I queued up Fury Cutter over there with uh, Pinsir. Please don't die to the Energy Ball, man. Oh, 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 we got the flinch in! No, 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 why did you hit me with that? I didn't queue my Sync Move yet! Okay, I guess it doesn't matter. Here's the Sync Move. Um, see how much damage you can do here. And... Cool. <laughs> Alright, Blitz, Iron Head, that Swift's definitely not going to take us out. Um, Iron Head again, we should take that out, right? Um, let's try our best to take out the, uh, yeah, no, we're not, we're probably going to fall to the, uh, Energy Ball over there. But, uh, maybe we might not, and, like, deal some damage here? Hey, Metagross. Um, oh, no, no, <laughs> That was okay, with, uh, you know, considering what we had left. We tie out the mid, which is nice. Did some damage to, to, I almost said Callum, but it's not Callum. Meow stick. So, not too terrible, not too terrible. Again, uh, like I said, this Vill run, I'm not going to rush it. Um, not that I really rushed. I think I, like, rushed one. It was the first one or second one. I can't remember. I think second run. Uh, but yeah, we're good. Um, decent pace. And uh, just going to try out some fun teams, for the most part. Anyways, uh, that's the for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Like if you enjoyed this video, subscribe to my channel for some more of my massive content. I'll see you guys in the next one.